Have you ever wondered how to take care of yourself after giving birth? After all, the journey doesn't end with childbirth. Postpartum self-care is a critical part of the process, every bit as vital as caring for your newborn. You've just brought a new life into the world, and that's an incredible feat. But it's also a transformative experience, one that brings a myriad of physical and emotional changes. Your body is recovering, your hormones are adjusting, and you're navigating the emotional roller coaster of new parenthood. It's a lot. That's why self care is so important. It's about giving your body the time it needs to heal, managing your emotions, and finding your balance in this new phase of life. This isn't about indulgence, it's about resilience. It's about giving yourself the same level of care you're extending to your baby. Because when you're stronger, healthier, happier, you're better equipped to care for your little one. Remember, taking care of yourself is not a luxury, it's a necessity. So, what are the steps to take care of yourself post-childbirth? First and foremost, rest is paramount. Your body has just performed an amazing feat. It's time to recover and rejuvenate. Aim to get as much sleep as possible. It might be challenging with a newborn. But remember, when the baby sleeps, you should too. Next, hydration. Keep a water bottle by your side at all times. Water plays a crucial role in your body's recovery process, helping to flush out toxins and maintain your milk supply if you're breastfeeding. When it comes to nutrition, think wholesome, balanced meals. Your body needs fuel to heal, and providing it with a variety of nutrients from fruits, vegetables, lean proteins and whole grains will aid in your recovery. Incorporating gentle exercises into your daily routine can also be beneficial. However, it's essential to consult your healthcare provider before beginning any exercise regimen. Simple movements like walking or stretching can enhance your mood, boost energy levels, and assist in your body's healing process. Don't forget your postnatal checkups. These appointments are a chance to monitor your recovery and address any concerns or questions you may have. Now let's talk about mental health. It's just as important as physical health and postpartum is a time of significant emotional changes. Meditation can be a wonderful tool for reducing stress and promoting relaxation. Try to carve out a few minutes each day for this practice. Journaling is another great way to navigate your emotions during this time. Putting your thoughts and feelings onto paper can provide a sense of relief and clarity. Last but certainly not least, seek support. Whether it's from loved ones or professionals, don't hesitate to reach out. Remember, it's okay to ask for help. It's okay to share your feelings. You're not alone in this journey. Each step you take towards self-care brings you closer to being the best mom you can be. To wrap up, let's quickly revisit the key points. We've been discussing the essential nature of postpartum self-care. It's not just about the physical healing after birth, but also about the emotional well-being of new mothers. Nurturing your body and mind is crucial during this delicate period. We've also gone over some practical steps for effective postpartum care. Remember to rest and sleep when your baby sleeps. Hydrate and eat nutritious foods to replenish your body. Seek professional help if you're feeling overwhelmed emotionally. Don't forget to move your body gently and gradually return to physical activity, but only when you feel ready. And perhaps most importantly, don't hesitate to lean on your support network. Reach out to your loved ones, friends or healthcare professionals when you need it. And remember, it's okay to ask for help. You're not alone in this journey. Taking care of yourself makes you a better caregiver for your newborn. So be kind to yourself, you're doing a great job. As we close this guide on postpartum self-care, we want to reiterate that you are not alone in this journey. You are doing an amazing job, and it's okay to ask for help. Remember, caring for yourself enables you to better care for your newborn. In the meantime, if you've found this video helpful, don't forget to give us a like. It helps us know that we're providing content that is valuable to you. And if you want more guides and tips like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button. We're here to support you through this incredible journey of motherhood. Thank you for watching. And remember, you are strong, you are capable, and you are doing a great job.